Hey guys, how's your summer going? I hope you are having a fun break and that you have some awesome vacations planned. For me, I don't have any vacation plans yet, but we're thinking about maybe going to either Portland, Austin, Hawaii for sure, um, but not until maybe January. I'm dying for a vacation, so where do you guys suggest that we go? Uh, definitely somewhere relaxing, no city life. Um, yeah, my husband and friend wants to go to Europe, but I have this very, very bad fear of flying, so... I have to get over that hump before uh, they can talk me into going to Europe, but I would love to go to Portofino or the Amalfi Coast one day and maybe Paris too. If you guys have ever been there, tell me where I should go. One of my other goals is to vlog daily. I don't know if there's going to be much to talk about, but I just wanted to have a better conversation and communicate with you guys every day. First off, I wanted to say thank you so much for all of your amazing and supportive comments about the video that I did on my dad and the heart. Um, it was so therapeutic to read through those and I read every single one and I wanted to say thank you, thank you, thank you so much for helping me through this. And I've actually never been able to talk about this and connected with anyone on a deeper level about what I was going through um, growing up with my dad and his heart condition other than my family but even then it was a little hard but reading through the comments and seeing how a lot of you guys went through the same thing made me feel like I wasn't alone and it was just so so good to talk it through with someone that understood so thank you but that brings me to my other point is that a a few months back, I posted a photo about a cookbook club, and I didn't actually figure out how I was going to make it work with you guys um, to cook together, but now that one of my goals is to do a daily vlog, it makes it a little bit easier to talk about the progress and about the recipe and whatnot. So, the first book that I'm going to cook through for the cookbook club, and you guys are welcome to join me, is this one. It's Vietnamese Home Cooking by Charles Fan. One of my goals is to really connect with my roots, Vietnamese roots, and really learn about Vietnamese cuisine. I've only been cooking what my parents taught me, and I didn't write most of those recipes down growing up, so I don't really know how to make them, but hopefully cooking through this cookbook will kind of help me learn more about, you know, where I came from, what foods belong to each region, just really connect back to my Vietnamese roots. And I also wanted to start learning how to speak Vietnamese a little bit better. One of my aunts from Texas that came here recently told me that she really enjoyed watching me cook on YouTube, but she didn't really understand me. Sec or English is her second language, so um, I want to do a better job of connecting with my Vietnamese community. So, ciao uh, go. <laughs> that means hi, auntie. <laughs> um, oh, I can also teach you guys uh, Vietnamese too if you want. Um, how about today we count to ten? So, mok is one, hi is two, ba is three, bong is four. Nam is five, six is sao, seven is bai, eight is tam, nine is jin, and ten is mui. Yay! So now you can say you learned something new if you didn't know how to speak Vietnamese. Counting to ten. So real quick, I have the unedited proof version of this book because it was sent to the magazine that I used to work for and they put it on the free table and I was so excited that I just grabbed it, but I don't think this is the final version. So that's okay, I'm gonna cook through it anyways. Um, and the first chapter is soups. I'm gonna, okay, this is what we're gonna do. I'm not gonna be able to cook through every single recipe, but I'm gonna pick and choose maybe two or three from each chapter, and I'll post it on the blog um, every week, so be sure to check my website, Honeysuckle Catering, and my Instagram at Honeysuckle Catering to see when I post about it, and then you guys can either take the recipe from there or buy your own book, and then we can cook along. 
I've never done a cookbook club before, so if you guys have any feedback on how you wanna see it work, comment below. This is our cookbook club, so all comments and feedback is welcome. All right, let's see here. But yeah, so the first chapter is soups, and ooh, they have bong ba wei, which is um, this yummy beef. It's almost like they have pho ba, which is beef noodle soup, which is very popular. And I know a lot of you guys want, had requested for me to make a video on pho ba, but it takes like 10 hours to make it, so I wasn't able to produce it on the video, but I think doing it on the blog and taking photos is gonna be a lot easier, at least for me and my schedule. I still have a full-time job, so um, we'll make it work though, okay guys? And then at the end of the cookbook club, once we finish cooking through this book, I'll choose three of my favorites or our favorite recipes based on the feedback, and then I'll do a video on it. What do you think? I'm really excited about this cookbook club. I love having goals to work through. It gets me through the day. It gives me something to focus on. Um, and another really fun goal that I have for at least myself is that I love watching baristas make latte art. So I've always wanted to learn how to make latte art and those like cool swirls or hearts. Um, I always watch them and I snapchat them all the time, but I haven't exactly figured out how to make it myself. So if there's a barista out there that wants to teach me, give me a holler. All right, guys, so that is my vlog for the day. I don't have a lot to talk about, but I would love to hear about how your day's going. Um, I will also talk about maybe like my favorite TV shows, just issues, things that I'm going through on a daily basis, or let me know what issues and questions or anything. I'm an open book, so just let me know. Thanks you guys, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.